Welcome to Hidden Talent Show. Today we have an incredible, amazing performer. I am no longer a human, and it sucks. These contestants are going to compete to find out what the hidden talent is. Are we talking vagina? Yeah, baby, I'm, I'm a little maybe too gay for this one. <laughs> but they don't know that they're going to compete in performing that hidden talent at the end of the episode. How could this be wrong? <laughs> I'm sorry. It feels so right. Welcome to Hidden Talent Show! It's a game show where very few of us know what's going on. We have a live audience. Woo! Yeah! I have one hidden talent. Oh, good. What is it? It might not be that fun. Wait. Uh, oh, that's not that good. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that person's as bad. I can make my eyeballs jiggle. Wait, what? Which is less of a talent and more just gross and weird. Let's see. Well, come here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They jiggle. The audience, it's I weird promise and it's gross. Good. That was cool. All right, so how is this game played? I'm going to ask our contestants some questions and have them do little tasks. They're going to guess the answer. Whichever of the two is closer to the answer, I'm going to give them a point. Now, every three points they get, they actually get to ask a question to the expert. The expert's over there. We can't see the expert, but they're there. My name is Jack Williams. I am a ventriloquist. And I am Jackie Diamond. I'm so excited to be here and show that I am not a ventriloquist and he's the weird one. Okay. Ventriloquism is comprised of acting, vocal training, and puppet manipulation, and comedy as well. So what you want to do is uh, you move your eyes like this, right? That's what you do and you can move your eyebrows like that, and you can move your mouth like, ah, you know? <laughs> and then you can, if you're feeling sleepy, I usually do when you talk. Okay, and you go like, like that. Jackie, can you show us Jack's features? Uh, yeah, he can uh, do this. <laughs> and now, a word from our sponsor. Viator is an app that helps you book your travel experiences. They've got over 300,000 travel experiences around the globe, and I can vouch for them myself. A couple summers ago, I went to Greece. We planned our entire trip using experiences off Viator. Oh yeah, we got some goats. <laughs> we went on a wine tour in beautiful Santorini. We went on a walking tour throughout Athens. Beautiful sunset, even more beautiful goat. <laughs> I saw all the statues, all the muscled, naked people, forever uh, in stone. <laughs> it really was a wonderful trip. It just gave me so much confidence to use Viator every single time. And Viator has millions of traveler reviews, including myself. It takes all the guesswork out of traveling. And if you're looking for just something else to do in your town, they've got experiences in most of the major cities here in America. Make sure you check it out. Thanks to Viator for sponsoring this portion of today's video. And now back to you, Keith. <laughs> Your first question is, mm -hmm. what 90s children's show first inspired our expert? Mm. Binya, binya. Let's all go to Gala Gala Island. That's binya, right. Binya. Gala Gala Island. Your Very audience is way too young for this. They're going to be like, you old man, what are you talking about? It's a good one. Rugrats. I'm gonna go Rugrats. I started doing ventriloquism at uh, 12 years old. I discovered it uh, by watching uh, Goosebumps and I saw Slappy and I just thought, I want one of those. <laughs> You're both incredibly wrong. Okay. So I'm trying to decide which of you is closer to correct. And I'm gonna actually go with Gullah Gullah Island. So one point. He didn't even know that he, I had to, I said Gullah 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 Island. Oh, is this, but you, 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 you wanna play like this? Your answer. Know it. You didn't claim he, it as your answer. He didn't even no. What are you doing? I don't know. I love like, it. Like I'm gonna go <laughs> fight you or something. You didn't know the name. Like, hey, who, Damn it! You're arguing with me, but like protecting. I don't understand. Like many talents in the world, Kentucky is important. But why is Kentucky important to this particular talent? The Derby. Yep, fried chicken. <laughs> it's a fried chicken maker on the other side of the wall. I guess it. <laughs> I will say that, Marissa, you are closer. Ah. Once again, very wrong. Okay. Unbelievably incorrect. So not, no one's okay. close, but no, she's but closer. No, but there, there are elements to Marissa's answer that are much closer than a fried chicken machine. Okay, so one point to Marissa, one point to Johnny. Woo! I'm on the board, I'm on the board. And see, look how supportive I am. Okay. Could you tell me what's so tricky 
about the labials. Are we talking vagina? Yeah, baby, I'm, I'm a little maybe too gay for this one. <laughs> <laughs> I can only ask you this question. What is so okay, tricky okay. about those labials? You're not saying labia. You're saying labial. Labials. I had a surgery on my labrum, oh. which is a shoulder. Thing. Uh oh. Why do I feel like that is a part of an instrument? Mm. Huh. Because you didn't say lips, but like getting the air into it. If you want to say the word basketball as a ventriloquist, you have to use letter substitution. So you replace the B with a D. So you're really saying basket doll. And I always have to think of the letter B when I'm saying it. So I put my tongue on the roof of my mouth and I'm like, that get doll, that get doll. And I put my teeth together, basketball, the, the, the. Points for Marissa. Ah! But I loved both answers. It's time to change things up a bit. I want to see you do something cool for me. Can we get some water out here? I'd like you both to show me something impressive with that water. Maybe the way that our expert might impressively use the water. Do you know what you're going to do? Yes. OK. Let me try. <laughs> Is this studio a rental? <laughs> it is, but we're gonna keep that podium, so. Was that impressive? I was very impressed, yes. Oh, look at Marissa go. She just oh. drinking it? Hmm. Oh. Oh! Uh. <laughs> Except. I want to give a point to Johnny because of how much I enjoyed it. But to be honest, it wasn't as close as Marissa. So once oh, again, okay. Marissa gets a point. So Marissa, you're at three points now. It doesn't mean you have to use it. You just know we have three points to one point. Wow. So there's a burping chicken man behind us. <laughs> Could you each tell me about little Timmy? So little Timmy is what Tiny Tim goes by to his friends. Yeah. He is the guy from The Christmas Carol who says, God bless us, everyone. And he works every year at Christmas time. Little Timmy is the youngest of the three, the golden child, Ooh. ended up murdering seven women across the state of Florida. And because he's a very Florida. Are you like walking you know? toward me? What's happening and with you? <laughs> <laughs> Little Timmy murdered. Okay. Um, seven women across the state of Florida. And he got finally got caught after five months of horror. Horror? Horror. Or, okay, not horror. Not horror. Uh, horror. 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 Five months of horror. Oh, five months of horror. <laughs> Anyways, who got closer? Anyhow, that's a good question. So, uh, Marissa, you, uh, you uh, made up a beautiful story just then. And I would say that, Johnny, you also referenced a, a beautiful work of fiction. Thank you. Um, so, I'm actually going to give you both points. Oh! So, it's now four to two. Hello. Hi. Does your talent involve your face? Yes, it does. Okay. Great. Okay. Okay. Great, Great question. Wow. Okay. All right. During the 16th century, mm. this talent was sort of like weirdly viewed. In what ways? Don't really know history. Never been there. Never experienced that. But I believe that the, there was a witch hunt and they thought, you're a witch if you can do it. In the 16th century, there were plagues. Mm -hmm. Plague remnant on your face. No. Uh, no, I'm going to stop you right there because I don't know where you're going with this. But actually, Johnny, <laughs> I'm going to give you a point. Johnny! Is that three? Is that three? Is that three? Is that three? That's right. Is that means three? Johnny three? has three points. Marissa's down to one point. Can I cash those points in? Sure. Does this talent involve a an instrument of some kind? Mmm. Sort of. Ah, uh, yes. Sort of. Sort of. Sort of. Sort of Everyone's favorite yes or no answer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yes and no. <laughs> All right. Well, let's stop listening to you and let's start looking at what you can do artistically. I need you to draw something for me. Okay. I want you to draw me a very famous character involved with this talent. Okay. Coaster Joe. Coaster who? Joe. Joe. 
Coaster Joe. Coaster Joe for he sure. He sounds like a burp, 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 Has a hat. Yeah. Okay. Oh, well. Four, three, two, one. Show me Coaster Joe! Hey. Coaster Joe. Hey. I gotta take a look. Hey. He's an old prospector. So this is Coaster Joe. He's got a green mustache, just for a little pizzazz. He's a cowboy, but he's a bony cowboy. Mm. So if he falls off of a horse, dunzo. Coaster Joe comes from a very wealthy family and hasn't worked a day in his life. Um, and he just coasts through life. Based, I'm gonna Yikes. base it on looks alone. Can I see them one more time before you crumple it up? I'm gonna give a point to Johnny. Oh. Well deserved, well deserved. And are you gonna hang my artwork, please? Yes, please. Could you tell me, what is their most utilized body part? Mouth, mouth, mouth. I'm gonna go mouth. I'm gonna go feet. Hmm. <laughs> tell me why. Well, feet, there's from not everything many you, body From parts. everything you've learned so far, tell me why. I believe that this person <laughs> uses their feet to make roller coasters. <laughs> Coaster Joe. Right, you know that the, the guest is not Coaster Joe. What? Oh. <laughs> that was just a character. Oh, I was just excited. Just like the guest is not though. Little Timmy. Yeah. These are just important figures in the history of this town. Great, I'm gonna give a point to Marissa. Much closer. Much closer. All right, let's move on to this next question. Could you mime for me this item? A gottle. Mime for me a gottle. Show me, show me what a gottle is. Hmm. <laughs> this is how pregnant women do it. Hmm. I'm not sure who's right. <laughs> I would say the person who is miming a gottle best is what Johnny is doing as a gottle in this instance, as, wow. as, as, as having a gottle. Give I'm it so up for sorry. Johnny. I'm so sorry. Let's bring out the ball. The ball! Now, this ball isn't actually a part of the talent, but there's something you could do with this ball that that action is something this talent also could do. Demonstrate the action. Okay. A spike! Ooh, <laughs> that was good. Ooh, okay. So mine is gonna be, <laughs> just a repeat of last one, but now I don't have to mine that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wait, let's take, oh, let's take, beautiful. let's take our maternity show. Oh, this is nice. Uh, um, you're both wrong, but <laughs> I will say How could this be wrong? <laughs> I'm sorry. It feels so right. This is the action we were looking for. Throw. Toss. Marissa? Yes? You were not correct in your demonstration of the ball, but I'm gonna give you a point. Yes! But now I'd like to ask you, what is a glottis. Thing hanging in the throat. back of your throat. The the but glottal, that might be the epiglottis. Glottal, yes, and there's like glottal strain, isn't there? I remember in show choir, <laughs> them saying something about your glottis, you <laughs> drop it. Yeah. So can I, you, can I, you guys do more of whatever that was? <laughs> I, <laughs> points for both. Yeah! Teamwork. Right now, at the end of all of those questions, Marissa, you have four okay. points again, and Johnny, you have three. So both of you have the ability to ask a question. You've gotten a lot of clues. Can I go ahead and ask? Yeah. Question! <laughs> I only hear one voice. However, is this a talent that you perform alone? No. Here's my question. Is this a talent that you perform with Puppets. Yes. Okay, some really good questions. Both of you look like you have an inkling of what it is, so I'm gonna move us right now to the guessing phase. You're gonna both write down what you think the hidden talent is. Marissa, you have one point left, so would you like to reveal your answer first, or would you like Johnny to reveal his answer first? I? Just for fun. Would like to go first. Marissa, <laughs> let's see your guess of the hidden talent. Okay, my guess is Puppeteering! That's not my guess. Johnny, That's not my guess. What is your guess? My spelling is atrocious, but I'm guessing ventriloquism. Johnny, you got it right! Woo! Johnny got it right! Here's the exciting thing! Okay! Now, now the game 
changes entirely. It's no longer just about you figuring out what it is. It's about you figuring out how to do it. That's no. right. Here in a moment, you two will face off in a ventriloquist challenge. You have no time to prepare. We're going to literally stand you right over there. We're going to turn the lights off. We're going to put spotlights on you. Whenever the spotlight comes on on you, you're going to be a ventriloquist. No. That's right. Yes. Get up and come on with me. Come on with me. This is our guest. This, this is our guest. Get on this mark right here. Uh, my name is Jack Williams. I'm a ventriloquist, and I am the scary Dudley. Here's how this is going to work. In a moment, we're going to turn off all these lights. We're going to put a spotlight on our expert here. They're going to demonstrate, but at any point, the spotlight can turn up on you. Now, because you got it right, it will come up on you first. And by a panel of myself, Rachel, and the audience, and the ventriloquist here, we will decide who did it best, therefore awarding who actually wins Hidden Talent Show! Yay! Okay. Go! Ah, go! Ah, Start okay. performing for us! Uh, okay. Huge round of applause! <laughs> yes! My name is Rascal! Oh, do you spell it Rascal? Yes, you spell it Rascal. <laughs> what do you pronounce it? Rascal. That's such a, oh, okay. <laughs> You're done. Well, now that we are revealed, I feel like Keith gave some pretty good clues. Yeah, he did. Yeah, we uh, talked really fast like this, like this, like this, like this, like this, like this. Okay, well, um, you know. Oh no. I mean, I think I have to go with the chef, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, and I'm trying to find his hole. <laughs> oh wait, wrong ass. <laughs> You're gonna wanna get that puppet on. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm wasting precious time. Okay, what's his name, what's his name? Hey, sir, oh. <laughs> wow, that was really lame, don't you think? That was so lame, you took so long. <laughs> Did you finally find the hole? <gasps> Rascal. Oh, hey, uh, uh, what's your name, puppet? <laughs> My name is Johnny. <laughs> no, my name is Johnny. No, John, John, Johnny, it's French. <laughs> I'm Johnny Gatau. Oh, well, that's funny, because I'm Johnny Cakes. This is my, oh, I'm just fully talking, hang on. <laughs> okay. You said roof of your mouth? Yes. Ho, ho, ho. Wee, oui, wee. Oui. <laughs> I am French. Ho, oh, he, he. So a dog twister is a ventriloquist. It would be like this. You ready? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Okay. It's like this. Sally sells seashells by the seashore. Sally sells seashells by the seashore. Sally sells seashells by the seashore. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. Sally sells seashells by the seashore. But there can be only one winner, only one person who did actually possess this hidden talent. And the winner of today's hidden talent show is gonna be revealed from a confetti cannon! Here we fucking go! Here we here we fucking go! Hey! Marisha! Marisha! Congratulations, Marissa! Yeah, you love me! They'll have to compete in that talent itself. Wow. See ya! Yeah. Bye. It looks like you still have a tag on you. Yes, the try guys will return me after the shoot. Oh. Wow, you really called the try guys out. That's fed up. <laughs>